Hi, Jeffrey Douglas here. Today we're out in Anza Borrego. We just ran out for a quick trip uh, overnight uh, from San Diego. Looking forward to uh, spending some time out here. One thing I really love about uh, Anza Borrego is you can really camp basically anywhere you want. You have to stay fairly close to a road, but uh, you don't have to have reservations. Uh, you just come out to find a really nice spot, uh, very quiet, uh, very private, uh, really nice place to camp. So the other day we looked at the Hellenock Sunset Chair and along with those chairs we brought, bought this Table One from Hellenox. And um, this is really the first time we've had an opportunity to use it and so far we're pretty impressed. It comes in a very small case, extraordinarily light. I'll put the specifications for you in the video. But um, again, high, high quality. Not cheap, obviously, but uh, kind of, my dad says, you get what you pay for. So let's open it up and take a look at it. Kind of like the chairs, what you do is you take it out of the case and the uh, legs roll up underneath the, the top. And top looks like that. It's got two cup holders got a nice name on it. Uh, it's got some mesh here which is really nice because if you spill something on the table instead of pulling and making a mess it'll go through the mesh. Uh, easy to keep clean, very durable, very high uh, quality stitch and everything. Just like the sunset chair basically what you want to do with these is just kind of let them um, just kind of drop out and before you know it you've got a table. You can tell where the legs are because there's little nibs, rubber nibs, that will indicate where the base is and then where the top is is above. So what you do is you take these two um, pieces here and you fix it on the ball heads and you pull it out a little bit so that it, uh, it stretches out and click it in. So that goes in like that. Same way again with the other side. Click it in. So now you've got a nice table and what you need to do next is you put the top on. Now the table one has actually built in cup holders which is kind of nice uh, because if the wind comes up or something uh, your, your drink won't go on the ground. So this just clicks in like this, like that, over here and over there and now you've got a nice table. So you can see how easy that is to set up. Extraordinarily light, very, very light. Really like it so far. Well, so that's kind of the uh, table one. A little bit of a quick review for you. We will, again, just like the Sunset Chairs, we're gonna do a long-term review once we've had some experience with these chairs. But I have to say two thumbs up so far for both the uh, Sunset Chairs and also for the table one. Uh, one concern I had with this um, was this, this table is actually made for the chair one, so it's slightly less high than the sunset chairs, but it's really not objectionable. So the, the height difference doesn't really bother me. Um, it's, it's perfectly fine. So if you're, if you're going with the sunset chairs, um, this table still is really a good fit for that. Um, sun's starting to go down. It's a beautiful, beautiful night in Anza Borrego. I think it's going to be around 55 degrees tonight, so you can't ask for better than that. Quiet uh, evening out in the middle of nowhere. This is one of our favorite spots, kind of hidden away. You just don't even know about it. Um, so if you've not been out here, I would really recommend that you see this place. It's just fantastic. Also, I want to show you um, that we, um, this is of course my, one of my favorite beers, Modern Times, but this is how that will fit. Goes in there, holds it really snug. This is a little bit of a higher uh, can than normal, but it just does a really nice job there. So I really highly recommend this table. I highly recommend these chairs. You can see over here, we've got the back uh, backrest, which is basically the case for the sunset chair stuffed a little jacket into it. It makes a really nice uh, headrest. So until next time, I hope you have a wonderful day and we'll see you soon. Uh, 
Lonnie, you don't want to be in there. Get over there. 